I'm in, uh, I'm in Vegas right now. This is my mom's house. It's been a really crazy day. That's a, that's a lot of munchkins. I'm in what used to be my bedroom. This is now a designated guest room. It's about 4.45 and I'm getting ready for tonight's Sandpiper team banquet. This year's guest speaker for the banquet is Olympic champion Josh Davis. This morning, Josh and I did a really fun swim clinic for the Sandpipers together. When I do breaststroke, I pretend I'm Cody for sure. I go faster <laughs> on my breaststroke sets. There is no one in the world that is as good at doing clinics as Josh. He puts on a show for the kids and people love it and I admire it. And we're leaving for the banquet now. Yeah. Katie, you driving? Yeah. Oh. Oh. We are on our way to the banquet now. You guys remember my sister Katie. Hi. So Josh Davis is the first Olympian I ever met. The first Olympian who ever in interacted with me. He let me hold his gold medal as a little kid. I grew up watching him race. He's amazing. It would be 27 year old Josh Davis, triple gold medalist from the 96 Olympics. Most golds rowdy by any American man at those games. Four lengths of the pool. Josh Davis in lane four. 50 meter split route. He was ahead of American record pace. And Josh Davis has a full body length lead over the next best. Davis with a big lead as he makes the final turn for home. We'll check the split and we'll also keep track of the race for second now. It's ahead of American record pace now. Davis looks like he's going to win it. Who's going to finish second? It appears it might be Goldblatt. Davis and Goldblatt go one, two. And Davis sets an American record, 147.26. He breaks a 12-year-old mark set by Matt Biondi in August of 88. What a swim for Davis. Katie and I made it. We're just waiting for the valet to get here so we can go inside. We're actually definitely uh -huh. running late, 100% running late. The most fun part of the clinic this morning was racing the kids. I got up on the blocks and raced a bunch of them. That was super fun. We're halfway through the swim clinic. Josh and I are racing the kids. I've been beaten by two munchkins. Come on! Who's gonna beat me? Who's gonna beat me? Are you ready? I'm ready! I think we died. Way better. Did I win? Go. Katie and I are on the hunt for the banquet hall. We, are. we think we found the right place. We, we think. Did. I also raced Josh this morning. That was probably one of the more fun things we did. I raced him. Well done. You know I like to race, don't you? Would you like to see us race each other? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Josh is the best. <laughs> This is the legendary Josh Davis, the guy that I keep talking of. He's the guest speaker tonight. Today we raced in a 25 breaststroke. By the way, breaststroke was your idea. Yes, I, I felt like I could keep up with you on the pull down. I love my pull downs, but then after that it was it was not fun. I would have been happy with another stroke, but you were like, we're doing breaststroke. It, yeah, in hindsight, we, we need a rematch for fly. <laughs> fly would have been a lot closer. It was a good time. These little munchkins were at the clinic this morning. What was the coolest part of the clinic? When Josh when Josh did the 50 underwater. That's good. Josh did a 50 underwater and it was one of the coolest things I'd ever seen. I saw Josh do this almost 20 years ago and it was one of the most amazing things I've ever seen and he's going to do it again for the kids here today. It's a <laughs> it's a full underwater 50 dolphin kick and as like a 12 year old when I first saw it I thought it was the craziest thing I'd ever seen.
Phelps does it, Cody does it, Roger. We all do it. That was amazing. Do not try that at home. Do not try that at home. We are professionals. <laughs> Josh and I just finished the water portion of the clinic. Super fun. I think the kids had a good time. I think they enjoyed it. <laughs> oh, what's up, dude? Seven habits of highly effective swimmers. What I call core seven. Everybody say core seven. Core seven. He had an IU cap. <laughs> and we're done. You've been in the vlog before. Once. You've been in it before. Okay. I kinda you got the like best mom. This was the first pool I ever really, really trained at. This is the pool I grew up swimming in. This is the Desert Breeze Aquatic Center here in Las Vegas. And it hasn't changed. Actually, it's changed a lot. They've got way better lighting in here now, way better air quality in here now. When I grew up, the air quality was meh, but it's, it's good now. So if you're in the Las Vegas area, this is the team to swim for. This is where I grew up swimming. And it is a very special place for me. We're at the Bodyline Swim Shop here in Las Vegas, owned by my club coach, Ron Aiken. That, that's me on the door. I never thought that would happen. That's so cool. I'm on, I'm on a door. This is so cool. Yeah, they just walked down. Oh, I I the tear bag. I have a gold version of that bag. It's, uh, it's pretty legit. It's pretty amazing. Of all the days in Las Vegas it rains, maybe four days a year, it happens on the day that I come and visit. Of course, of course, of course. Perks of being one of the guest speakers, you get to eat first. Giving out some awards tonight. Here's what's happening. Ron is introducing. As I was saying, there's one of the things I like about me. Weekend. I'm gonna introduce him, is and then he's gonna talk. We gotta be quiet now. Ron's talking up there. Thank you, thank you. And Josh, I want to thank you for that. Thank you so much for coming here years ago, and thank you for being here today. Come on up here. Ladies and gentlemen, Olympic champion, American record holder. Thank you, Cody. Thank you, Stan Piper. Thanks, Coach Ron. Thanks to the coaching staff. Work and accomplishments of this team. This is one of the top teams in the USA right now. Congratulations to you guys. Are you okay? What's the answer What's the... You guys have a great season. I love you so much. That was awesome. <laughs> so, Cody, thanks again for the recommendation. Getting Josh out to come out here again. Good job, that kill it, kill it. Awesome. That I was think awesome. He shared some stories up here that can relate to everyone. Okay, so speeches are over. Josh killed it, gave a ridiculously inspirational speech. Got me choked up a couple of times. I think I did a decent job introducing him. Uh, they're doing senior slideshows right now. That's what's going on in there. They're showing pictures from the whole year and stuff. And I think it's good. I think it's been good. It is autograph o'clock. Yes. It's autograph o'clock. We got a line for autographs back here. <laughs> and then the dance floor later over there. Her mom said it was okay that I did that. winding down. For those of you out there who want to do clinics with Josh, where do they go? BreakoutSwimClinic.com. Three, the three-step process. Pick your best date, pick your favorite Olympian, and we'll pick the best price for you. We got big names, great prices with gold medal service. Pick your date, pick your Olympian, and we'll bring it right to you. Josh books all kinds of awesome Olympians, and he's the best, man. So if you're someone out there who keeps asking for this kind of thing, that's the place to go. Thanks, Cody. Right, you got it, man. You got it. Woo! And we're home. Had a truly wonderful and spectacularly fun time at the banquet this evening. 
It's late, I'm tired, I've gotta catch a flight in the morning to head back to Indy. Once again, thank you to the Sandpipers for having me and Josh today, it was a blast. The breakout clinics, they're awesome. I don't currently do a lot of clinics, I love doing them, I love engaging with people and interacting with young kids and letting them hold my gold medal and take pictures with it and stuff, cause that's what Josh did with me when I was little and that really inspired me and so I love doing that. In the future, I plan on doing a lot of them, um, especially post-competitive swimming, but for now I just do, I do a few of them. My mom has jellyfish. I want some. <laughs> you didn't name them? Mom, come on, you gotta name them. As always, make sure you guys are following me on social media, at Swim Miller on Twitter and at Cody Miller on Instagram. Vlogs every Wednesdays, podcasts regularly. Make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel. Click the little bell button so you get notified every time I drop a new video. Let me know in the comment section what we should name my mom's jellyfish. And until my next video, I will see you later.